Hello everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to build your own spirit box radio or scanning radio using a Adreno. Um, this is an Adreno Uno. And then we have a FM module uh, antenna, um, a USB patch cable to uh, program the Adreno, um, the patch cables or the jumper cables that will go from the radio to the Arduino and a 9-volt battery connector. Uh, this will power the unit. So I'm going to put everything together and uh, I will show you the diagram. I have diagrams um, as you see here. I'm going to put everything together. All right, so I have everything wired up. So on the Arduino, you'll see that there's a uh, that it's labeled the different uh, where the pins plug into uh, or the jumpers plug into. Um, so in this case, we want to, the power is five volt, the ground, uh, A4 and A5. And then the other ends plug in here onto the radio board. And then this cable is gonna plug into your computer. And we're gonna go ahead and get this programmed. So I'm going to take this over to my computer and record the recording session or the uh, programming session on the computer so you can see how it's done. I'll walk you through the uh, how to use the software and get the programming done. All right, so let's get started on that. We're plugged in. So first we're going to need a couple of things. I already have the side open, so you go here. So what you would need to do is download the Arduino um, software. So you go here, go to Downloads, uh, scroll down. Now, I'm running a Mac, so I already downloaded the program. So if you're running Windows, go ahead and download it here. Um, okay, so after we have that downloaded and we install the program, I have it installed already, so I'm going to open it up. And this is what it's going to look like. So it's going to pull up a sketch window. So what we're going to do is uh, open up a sketch. And I have the spirit box sketch already done. Open that up and then it's going to pop, pop up here. So in the sketch, you would need to um, select, this is a, the board selector. So um, you come here. Um, some people use the Arduino Mini. Um, the Mini is a good little board. I just prefer using the, the Uno. It's a little bit more expensive, but it works really well. Um, so we select that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to uh, uh, open up the port that we're going to use. Um, this is if you're going to use a Bluetooth, but in this case we're not. So we have the USB modem, so we have it plugged into there. And then what we're going to need to do, we need to add the libraries. So we're going to include the libraries, and we're going to say uh, we're going to select uh, add .zip library. So I have the library here on the desktop. I've already done this step, so but I'm going to show you how to do it anyway. So here we have it on the desktop. We're going to choose that. So see, it already says that we, uh, anyway, uh, I'm getting in that error because I already uploaded that. So, um, but usually if you have it, uh, if you don't have it installed, um, it's going to upload the, the um, it's going to say that the, that the library was added. Okay, so once that step is done, we're going to program the board. So we need to upload it to the Arduino. So we're going to click on this, on the Upload button. Now it says it's compiling the sketch, and now it's uploading. Okay, the uploading is done. So now we could uh, unplug it and uh, take it over and test it out. So let's go ahead and uh, unplug that. We're going to plug in. You're going to need um, also an external speaker. Um, the the radio board comes with an antenna, so you don't really need that unless you want to put it in a box, um, add a couple of a different type of antenna or something like that. 
um, which is always good to do. Um, and then we'll go from there. All right, so we're going to unplug it, and we're going to go test it out. All right, so now we have everything plugged in. So I have the 9-volt battery plugged into the, uh, into the Arduino. And then the, uh, so I have it. <clears throat> so there's no on and off switch. So as soon as you plug in, plug in the 9-volt uh, battery, the uh, radio will turn on. And so will the Arduino will boot up. I like using 9-volt rechargeable batteries. Um, they seem to work a little bit better than regular batteries and the lifetime is a little bit longer. So this radio is already on. Um, so I haven't even tested it out. So here we go. Just going to turn on the radio. So as you see, it scans pretty well, um, and that's pretty much it. So, you know, this project took maybe 20 minutes. So in about 20 minutes, you can have your own ghost box um, that you built yourself. You can put it in a box. Um, I've been building boxes for quite a while um, using different boards and things. Um, so I wanted to do some videos on teaching people how to build their own um, paranormal gear. This will be the first video in the series. And uh, if you have any requests that you want, want to see built, um, go ahead and uh, send me a message. You can please subscribe to the page and like this video and share if you like. Um, but I appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel so we can uh, build more projects together. All right, and uh, all these kits um, are, uh, will be in the description down below. You can click on the link. Um, I'll have the parts list. Um, I'll have the downloads to download the, uh, the program to program into the Arduino. Um, I'll have all the files. I'll have uh, um, directions that you can download, or you can just uh, follow the on-screen directions that I'll provide in the video. All right, if you have any other questions, feel free to ask. All right, thanks for watching.